Quilty Nature is continuing with the Dublin Mountains makeover, making these forests better for recreation and for nature. This is a long-term project and today we're going to show you some of the progress on one of our R&R, or Remove and Replant, sites here at Ticknock, the most visited of all Quilty forests in Ireland. Here's one of our areas where the commercial spruce plantation was felled last year and the wood was sent for processing into different timber products, such as for building houses. There are many benefits of commercial forestry, but because this area is so popular for recreation, located here on the capital city's doorstep, we've decided to manage these Dublin forests for people and for nature. Last year, the spruce was felled. Then we came back and prepared the site by pulling the leftover branches into piles, preparing the soil, and then planting the new native woodland. It's called a pioneer birch woodland, and we've planted a mix of downy birch, Scots pine, sessile oak, rowan, and holly. You can see we've put up a big fence to keep the deer out, because they love to eat the young trees, and without this fence, the trees won't have a chance. There is a gate for visitors to pass through the new woodland, and see how the trees are growing. The new trees are growing really well in their first growing season out on site. Here we have a birch tree, a pioneer species that is well adapted to growing on these mountain slopes in exposed conditions and on poor soils. There will be more R&R &R operations taking place across the Dublin mountains as part of the makeover. So when you're out for your walk in the hills, look out for these areas of new native woodland. In the long term, this will create a mosaic of biodiverse habitats and beautiful autumn colour across the hills.